A Currituck County teen accused of killing her newborn baby is out of jail. 16-year-old Rebecca Jo Blackmore is free on $250,000 bond. Police arrested her in June after she went to the hospital for medical treatment. Ten of your sides, Ava Hurdle, just returned from Currituck County where people are talking about this case. Ava? Nicole, those residents we spoke to have mixed feelings about this case. Blackmore was released just before midnight after her family posted bond. A sheriff's deputy stands watch to keep people away from Rebecca Joe Blackmore's home on Knott's Island. Back in June, the teen allegedly stabbed a newborn baby there and left the little girl in a closet. Neighbors have mixed feelings. One thinks Blackmore belongs behind bars. In jail. Why so? Because that was her child. That is my baby daughter, and I would protect her with my life right now. From Kay and John Barnes, this view. She was a good student in school, you know, well recognized in the community, and nobody knows why this happened. But yeah, I'm not against her being bailed on bond. We feel very sorry for the family. Yes. Blackmore was released under the following conditions. She has to maintain an address in Currituck County, must contact the sheriff if her address changes, maintain regular contact with her attorney, and work toward a high school diploma or its equivalent. We asked a legal expert by telephone about the 16-year-old getting out of jail on bond for a murder charge. You can have the most sensational charge in the world, and um, if otherwise a person has ties to the community, has never been in trouble before, always shown up to court, all of those things are taken into consideration by a court determining whether or not somebody's suited for a bond. And he admits Blackmore has not been convicted, but is innocent until proven guilty. Now, according to court records, Blackmore's family was able to work out financial terms with two bondsmen to get her out of jail. No trial date has been set. I'm Ava Hurdle, 10 on your side.